It's Friday, folks, and that means it's time for another episode of Ask the Expert with Rob Sutherland. Rob, my first question to you today is, why do people find it so difficult to recruit realtors? Because it's hard work. Because it's something you have to do every day. It's like going to the gym. How can you expect to get results from going to the gym? You buy the membership, you get all this workout gear, you think, okay, great, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get in shape, and lose weight, and then you never go. So how is it gonna work out? It's just like recruiting realtors. You've gotta put the effort in, or it's not gonna get the results that you want. There must be something that is prohibiting people from taking that first step. So what makes the recruiting process so complicated? Well, you're not giving someone a job. You're asking them to come from their office where they're already comfortable and making money to come to your office and pay your fees. Why would they do that? Well, they've got to be attracted to you as a person. They've got to be attracted to your office as a place to go. They've got to be attracted to your brand. Maybe it's the fees, maybe it's the leads, but there are a number of things that stop a person from moving because they might have deals on the go. A, a realtor who's got 20 or 30 listings, it's going to take forever to get him to move. So you got to target some people that don't, maybe don't have as many listings. It's a more complicated process than people take for granted when they think, oh, well, you just recruit realtors. They must just come to your office. Well, no, you've got to start thinking about their business and how you can help import it to yours. So the, if you build it, they will come idea doesn't necessarily work when it comes to recruiting realtors. I mean, if you're in a place where there is no offices that look good and you open a beautiful office, well, hey, they're going to come and check it out. And if you've got a great like system there, they're probably going to join, right? So building it for them to come actually might work in real estate. You know, there's so many people nowadays who are trying to start an office in their basement. How are you going to take that person seriously? Right. Well, is there a talent pool of people who can access them in order to recruit? Well, you'd think that there would be an easier way to find realtors that are looking for work, right? But there just isn't, right? They don't post their needs online. They're not applying for jobs. They're literally on their own like an entrepreneur. So kind of like during a small merger and acquisition with a company, you're trying to get this person to merger with your company, right? So you've got to reach out to them. You've got to call them by phone. You've got to email them. You've got to keep those kind of systems going all the time. And especially in summer when they're not so busy, they may have 10 listings in the early part of the year, but then summertime they've got no listings. So, hey, they're free and clear to move to a different office. Yeah, well, great information as always, Rob. And for more information on PBA, just click on the link, probrokeragency.com. And be sure to tune in on Monday for another episode of Ask the Expert with Rob Sutherland. We'll see you then. Copies for closers. <laughs>